So in front of us, we have 425 times 51. And we're going to do 1 times 5, 1 times 2, 1 times 4. I'm going to switch to red arrows. 1 times 5 will be 5. 1 times 2 will be 2. And 1 times 4 will be 4. Next, we will take this bottom 5 times 5. And we're going to put the answer right underneath this 5 and underneath the 2. So first thing we do is we put the 0 right up here. And then we take 5 times 5 will be 25. We only take the second digit, number 5, we'll put it right up here. And the 2, we carry it to the top and put it above the other 2. We then take 5 times 2 plus the 2 on top. And we know the answer will be 12. So we put the second digit, again, the 2 right here underneath the 4. And we bring the 1 and we put on top of the 4. We then take 5 times 4 plus the 1 on top. And the answer will be 21, which will write both digits right up here. We then add up the numbers. We always start from the right column. 5 plus 0 equals 5. 2 plus 5 equals 7. 4 plus 2 equals 6. 0 or nothing plus 1 equals 1. 0 plus 2 will equal 2. And of course, we always double check. Yes, you could type these numbers in the calculator, but let's do it manually. So we're going to flip the factors. We're going to put 4 to 5 on the bottom, and the 51 we're going to put on top. With the help of the little red arrows, let's multiply. 5 times 1 equals 5. 5 times 5 will equal 25, and both digits we write up here. Next, we put the little 0 right up here, and then we go over to the 2, and 2 times 1 will be 2. We write it underneath the 5. We then take 2 times 5. The answer will be 10. And both digits we write up here. Now you think we will add these up, but we still have the 4. So we're going to put two zeros right up here. And then we take 4 times 1 will be 4. We write it underneath the 0. We then take 4 times 5, and the answer will be 20. And we put both digits right up here. Finally, we add them up. And we always start with the right column. 5 plus 0 plus 0 equals 5. 5 plus 2 plus 0 equals 7. 2 plus 0 plus 4 equals 6. 1 plus 0 equals 1. And 0 or nothing plus 2 equals 2. And they match. The factors on top, we flip them over as shown by the arrows. And the answers on the bottom is both 21, 6, 7, 5. So the answers match. We did it correctly.